Do you need a moment? No. No. Can I take one? Maybe? <laughs> Sorry, I was just that. Uh, just friends, you know. It's, it's, it's going off the air. Here it is! Your moment is in. My impression is that what has been charged thus far is abuse which I believe technically is different from torture. The uh, Bush, uh, I saw your speech last night to the Arab people. What was that? Do I have to do everything in this country? They don't care about things like the dumb prisoners getting humiliated. The average Arab is looking at us like Jerry Maguire. They're like, hey, show me the money. We're wasting our time apologizing for idiots they don't care about. They want money from that oil that's under their feet. They want to sit down on a nice couch like anybody else they have to work, look at their fat, happy kids in $200 sneakers and iPods. <laughs> and you know what? That will solve everything because money solves violence. What is so hard for people to understand about the fact that there's very little killing in Beverly Hills or Kuwait, and there were always shootings in East New York and Palestinian refugee camps. You kill all the crazy bastards in Iraq, and in five years, the only sign of radical Islam will be a bunch of Arabs TiVoing Hezbollah, where are they now, on VH1. You understand that? Nothing. Hey. 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 Good to see on? you, fella. <laughs> hey, dude. Hey, guy. What's Don't going on? Hey. What's going on today? Oh, well, today, I'm glad you asked, guy, because <laughs> today <laughs> President Bush went on two Arab TV networks. Oh, that was yesterday. To denounce the abuse of Iraqi prisoners right. by U.S. soldiers. Here's a look. Ready? We're a great country because we're a free country, and we do not tolerate these kind of abuses. The people in the Middle East must be assured that, uh, that we will investigate fully, that we will find out the truth. <laughs> he goes to that free well a lot, doesn't he? But what do you guys think? Quinn, the man's out of touch. We have a seven... <laughs> He's cutting taxes. Jesus. We have a... <laughs> Would you shut up? Where's it? He's just so eager. <laughs> I'm eager. Yeah. I'm, I'm, Dub, you try and score. We don't like it. Yeah. I'm not trying to Shut up and go ahead. I can't wait to the exciting wait, speech. Listen to me. Go ahead. It's speech. not a speech. I'm saying he's cutting taxes. We have a $7 trillion national debt. I don't even think he believes it's a real number. Is it a real number? Trillion? No, I think somebody must have said something. Somebody said, Mr. President, you know we have a seven trillion dollar debt. He was like, seven trillion, billion, bazillion. Get out of my office, boy. You know what, though? Look. No left. <laughs> he didn't even say the, sorry, though. He didn't actually apologize. Why did should he? he? He shouldn't. You know what? They drag, they oh, drag our bodies through the street like dead rugs, <laughs> and we say nothing, and nothing happens on the news. We take a couple sexy photos, and everybody's pissed <laughs> off. <laughs> it's true. I mean, people are making... I think the Arabs are laughing at us, going, boy, they really are soft. All they want to know is how they're going to get their, you know, Kazanich out of the scene. They don't care if we do this to a couple of dregs. They don't give a damn about those idiots. I don't like the way they're blaming the soldiers, though, man. Uh, you could tell. If you watch the pictures, they're not, they're, they're not like, having a good time when you're doing foul stuff to person and having a good time and it's you and it's off the cuff face. it's like hey yeah yeah get, get, but it, it's very like you get on top of him you get on top of him <laughs> you get it's you know it yeah. came down from somebody I really, that, that, I, you can't blame those kids for I wanna, that I really do want to meet that girl though she's pretty that she girl like that little, girl. She's, a little, she's a little dominatrix she had the little she was looking Get him on the leash today yeah get him on the leash I like yeah, that yeah I don't like that I'm sure gonna, that'll go for big she's, she's a hot number she's gonna she's gonna be like 250 thing. American to get that done. <laughs> but let me ask you this. What? First of all, somebody explain <laughs> to me. It's like 300. Oh, oh, the hell with it. I just didn't hear. Let's move on. What's next? Jesus, Colin, what's wrong? I just I had a mood swing. Oh. Disney, <laughs> Disney has refused to release Michael Moore's new documentary, Fahrenheit 9-11, that links President Bush with bin Laden's family and criticizes the war in Iraq. Here's more on why he thinks Disney did it. And followed by Michael Eisner. Disney was afraid of offending uh, Jeb Bush. 
uh, because they were up for millions of dollars of tax abatements and tax incentives in the state of Florida. Any company has the right to distribute or not to distribute. We have, we uh, informed both the agency that represented the film and all of our companies that we just didn't want to be in the middle of a politically oriented film during election year. Now, I hate to defend this uh, guy that I hate, Michael Moore, but are you trying to tell me, you just said, we don't want to do a f politically oriented film in an election year. Yeah, you don't want anything with any kind of content. That's a bad idea. You know, just keep making the usual him. stupid, awful stuff you make. <laughs> Eisner and the rest of these dumb Hollywood idiots. It's all part of the right-wing Jewish co uh, conspiracy. Holy Jesus. Oh, holy please. mother. <laughs> you, you really are an independent <laughs> film. Yeah, he, happen, really you? Is. he really is trying to make a stand. <laughs> what the, the hell? The I'm Jewish here right. Here <laughs> and cut. We'll do that again. You think... Doug, Doug, you think you're kidding, but guess what? All the people on the left would go, yeah, there is a right-wing Jewish, uh, right-wing conspiracy, no, and they'll say, say Ron's fell, but Paul, what's that? They would say that there's a left-wing Jewish conspiracy, No, but a lot right of people say it's a right-wing one, too. Wolfowitz, Remember? Pearl, Ron, Wolfowitz, Pearl, and, uh, what's the other? Right. What's the, the Jews thing? do run a lot of shit. Could you stop eating and pay attention? What are you, homeless? <laughs> Listen, answer the question. <laughs> the Listen, bottom line is, do you agree with Michael Moore as much as it disgusts me to agree with him? I do agree with why? him. Why? I, uh, I agree with him, too. Yeah. I hate him. Why? Why do I hate him? The guy, the guy no, is good, man. Please. He's an honest well, dude. It's, it's great. You it's, it. it's good for him. He's, he's an honest, honest guy, man. He's really honest. It's that, great for because his book got banned. It went to number one. So maybe right. this, it is know. good for him. It's all hype. That's all he's doing is hyping it up so that people will be like, oh my God, he's we have not to see hyping this movie. it up. Disney's what hyping it up. But he's, about? he's getting into it because it, 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 the only negative publicity is going to help him. He How could care. anybody argue with what Moore is saying? And yes, I am hungry. How could anybody argue with what Moore is saying? About what? About not About what Moore is saying. There's obviously some sort of tax issue in Florida, which sure. is, else wouldn't they want to put it out? You want of to lose course. $35 million? Of course. Well, they lost care. $75 million on Alamo. He, it, it serves them. <laughs> it serves Disney. They want to get slick. They want to do business with Mayor Max. You want Mike, to be independent. Right. Talk. Mike. But let me tell you this about Michael Moore. Honest. Michael Moore, as you call him. He was so honest that I'll never forget in his play. And this is one of the reasons I hate him. Well, when he well, said, what play, uh, Colin? Stop so making dumb. 1946 references. Was that this nobody <laughs> knows. Stop always trying to prove you're smarter than everybody. We never heard of Michael Moore's play. We saw that dumb goddamn documentary he did, and we're going to see this one. So let's, let's, stay, let's stay with everybody else. You know, when Michael Moore first started, you know, we don't care. Yeah. He is right. We, this dude, <laughs> he from, is right. From what the average guy knows, Michael the, Moore is honest. We don't want to go back the to play, the CIA film. The there, play, Colin. that that play last year, by the way, it ran for about nine months in London, wait, and stop, New York. Wait a minute. Sorry. Did anybody hear this play, please? But plays are fake anyway, right? Nobody, Colin. No, not one person. Stop trying to be above us. Oh, Liz, did you hear folks, about this play? Folks, he really should come with a pipe. He, the little wrist. Oh, Michael Moore. Folks, I really apologize. That I was trying to be above you by having heard of a play. Hey, I'm in a play. It's very respectable. Go yeah, on. Yeah, it's fun. called the Why Marijuana I Slept Laws. with Can Tom I get Brady. My... <laughs> 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 Is that a snap? Oh, you're dealing with illiterates. You're dealing with illiterates. I mean, it's not if like they I said. Had a play, they, got, if they were starting a play, it was called the illiterate dumb. monologues. I can't take this kind of right. ignorance. Oh. You understand what I said? A play, <laughs> and you went on a rampage, and dummy, of course. Look who's on Why your side. Why am I dumb? Why am I dumb? Leave him alone. Why are you calling you pieces? You're, you're, you're picking on the dumbest person. He shows you're not smart. That proves he's not smart. He is the people, Pick on this smart looking He represents us. Most of us didn't know Michael Moore did a play. We know that dumb movie he did with the cartoon in it. That's all we know of this goofy Why pedophile face. <laughs> All they have to do we is, don't care. We know him from the from the Oscars. All, but, all, they, have, all they have to do is animate this thing, and they can say whatever the hell they want. <laughs> do, you uh -huh. know, all right, does anybody all right. have any weed? <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back after this commercial. <laughs> On the road to the White House, candidates address what it takes to be president. This is George Bush. What were his qualifications? Apparently he was drunk until he was 40. Don't miss a special Indecision 2004 Friday Night Stand-Up, tomorrow at 8.30 on Comedy Central. This special Indecision presentation is brought to you in part by Singular Wireless and by Volkswagen. College is in our immediate future. Only not the same one. Florida, Texas, Ivy League. 
All three of us in college, at the same time, we need a way to keep in touch. That won't cost us a lot. With Singular's Family Talk, you can call any Singular customer for free, no matter where they or you are. Add a line for $9.99. Hurry, offer ends June 20th. We call it our More Money for Books. Yeah, right. Books. Plan. Plan. Singular Nation Family Talk. Another reason Singular fits you best. The Volkswagen Spring Sales Drive is going on now. That means it's a really good time to get behind the wheel of your very own road-hugging, German-engineered Volkswagen. Each one is packed with cool features and backed by a four-year, 50,000-mile limited warranty. And now, for a little while at least, you can get a new Passat GLS 1.8T for just $239 a month. So see your local dealer soon, because like spring, this will be over before you know it. Hey, you never told me. What was that? Crunchy! Guys? Only Taco Bell has the spicy, melty, crunchy stuff you crave. Spice up the night. Open till midnight or later. Oh man, there's a line. Pro Style. Shirts and pants that do it all. With IO Digital Cable Service and your Showtime subscription, you can order Showtime On Demand. Enjoy the best of Showtime anytime with Hollywood hits, family shows, and original series like Soul Food all on your schedule. Start your choice when you want and enjoy them as often as you like. Even pause, rewind, and fast forward. Order Showtime On Demand. Available with IO Digital Cable Service from Cablevision. Call to order IO today. 1-866-34-DIGITAL. I'm in a band called Lilix, and I was hating my contacts. So I went to the eye doctor. He told me about these new lenses called AccuView Advance. Introducing new AccuView Advance brand contact lenses with HydraClear. I definitely feel comfortable wearing them for a long period of time. Do your eyes thirst for all-day comfort? Then get details on a free trial pair of AccuView Advance. Call 1-800-573-0097 and experience all-day comfort with HydraClear for yourself. Call 1-800-573-0097 today for details on how to get your free trial pair. City officials in Miami are hoping to recruit more black police uh -huh. officers by dropping the swimming requirement for applicants. <laughs> what do you have to say to that, cuz? Well, here's the big problem. You know, people can't swim, admit We can't swim. You stink. Oh. If you could swim, you wouldn't be in this we predicament. Do we do swim. <laughs> we know oh, you we know can swim. We do swim. I think. I'm going to get ready. Hey, hey, look. Let I'm going to tell you. I'm going to get ready to be scientific oh, about it. Finish. When we When we grow up, black people, it, swimming is not a competitive thing. We don't do any sport where I can't say your mother afterwards, your mother ain't, you know, talk about your mama or, right. or say, hey, you ain't, you suck. It, swimming is a very lonely, very, we, we're very So is chain snatching, but somebody's pretty good at that. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Hey, we're, think, we're really, we're community type of people, man, so that's why we do it. We're very good at team sports. We don't play golf. We don't swim. We barely play tennis now. It, we really don't. It's just, it's not enough Colin. Blacks, you know, Colin. Blacks don't <coughs> swim. White people don't dance we do, fire We do swim. Here's it's the crux of the issue. We're not proficient at, we're not competitive at it, but if we was to get competitive, you, know you keep opening your white mouth, we're going to start swimming, <laughs> and then you're going to be oh. talking about, oh, they take over swimming you're too. Right. You're right. Oh, that was a black guy doing a black this voice. Is, this is Haitians that is saying that. Am I right? I yeah, mean, oh, isn't that. that how they got here? They should be. They should put a badge on the when they get here. The whole hey. police department should be Haitians. The problem is, listen to me. Would you listen to me, please? Well, I'll solve, solve it right now. Say something's got a solution. Solve it. Solve it. Yes. yes. Solve it. Go ahead. Yes. Listen to me. Don't swing. Just go yes. The black man makes a bad swimmer. However, the black man. However, yes. we can swim. Shut up. However. We, we all can know swim, that. Though. Shut up. <laughs> However, <laughs> Let him we all know they have the upper hand in the 100-yard dash. Now, 
Listen to me. <laughs> don't move. Just tell him. That's exactly what no, Get it out there uh, now. That was it, Colin. Now no, no. he's sitting it. No, no. Now it wasn't it. it. Now he's going to try to add me. Has anybody ever been mugged here and then had the guy make his escape via waterway? There. Now shut up. You idiot. Wow, you saved that. You're really good. You want to play games with me? Dog, as I'm much rolling. as I love Wait. you, you saved your ass with that one. Because I'll right. tell you, I wasn't even going to not put you on again. I was going to boot you off this episode. <laughs> Colin, why can't Tony Camille ever say anything? I Tony, said a good one earlier. I know. Are you fine with that, Tony? Yeah, I just don't that's want good you. Enough. It's not that I give a damn about you. I don't want you bad mouthing me to other comedians. I want you to say that Kyle's a great guy. You they know already what I mean, know. Baby? They know you I, can't I, talk I, right. But I don't know you. <laughs> I saw you at the comedy awards. Did you say I can't talk right? Yeah. What does that mean, Tony? You have a problem with enunciation. No, Tony, I don't. I yes, you do. Oh, yes, you do. God. Tony, let me explain something to you, Tony. <laughs> we don't know each other that, mean, that well at all. We don't know each other. Okay? We don't know each other. You've heard... One of the reasons I have a problem with enunciation is because every day I have spontaneous new things to say. Unlike your friends that think they're so alternative, and yet they're doing the same old stuff every day, right. I like to work off the cuff for real. So once in a while I get a little upset and nervous, and I spittle, and I stutter. But, Tony... I find it endearing. I know, Tony, but I'm just trying to explain when you bring that message back to your friends. Is it that last stutter, one was pretty good, though, the punchline. You know, I'm sorry, you right? mumbled. What? You don't have what? Oh, oh Doug. Jesus! <laughs> Doug's still pissed. He actually turned on me. Doug. <laughs> no, no, I didn't. No, no. Go sit. All right, Colin, so. he's saying that you mumble. I, I, no, he's saying no. that the, the word... Go ahead. What are we gonna say? Anybody? I happen to listen, love. Listen, you know What's what? The this sucks because now, because you have to swim. If you're a police officer, almost surrounded by water, you should have to swim. And because you're black and you didn't have your own Why pool you when you were swim? a kid, it, that shouldn't matter. But I mean, to last what, are gonna, what are we gonna make basketball requirement Bobby. now? Shh. Bobby, we wait. throw one more thing. Of <laughs> one black you You're surrounded by Stop water. It. Doesn't mean you're. Let me say be something. Chasing. First of all, <laughs> Bob says your own pool like you grew up some rich white neighborhood. <laughs> yeah. This son of a bitch was in juvie for yeah. 11 years. <laughs> I'm you not kidding. Kid. I was in a, juvie. For what? First Shut time Bobby saw pulling his naked <laughs> and babysitting. And he acts like he had a nice pool and a happy childhood. Your childhood was awful. I was in juvie. Shut Dove your mouth. acts what? like he was in juvie. What do you mean I act Dove, like I was in juvie? You're getting a little out of control today, Dove. Dove likes the box. Watch out. Dove's I got some like fast hands. Juvie. I'm just saying what that. that. I let people I, butter let up my say, ass. Let me just <laughs> say something. Let me just say something. Okay. This is, this is really crap. Right. I'm serious. It this is. is crap. If you, it's swimming. You can't. You can learn to swim in five minutes. Well, and these guys don't want to go in and learn actually, how to I swim. I was not a good swimmer. I used to swim like that all the time because they say in New York, swimming style. Swim, look at your towels. Nobody steals your stuff. Can't the whole time. swim. This is. I just get sick of y'all qualifying what we can do. We admit that you said you couldn't do it. He just said I'm I sick of y'all qualifying what we can swim. do. Black you know what? He said swim well. We don't know. We. I didn't say we don't swim well. We don't swim as a. As a thing, but we can swim. Nobody's asking you for the cops I'll tell you exactly why. Metal in the breaststroke. I'll you're tell you exactly what it is. You're gonna swim 150 feet, and these guys are complaining. Whoever snatched the chain and dove into the ocean? <laughs> God, you said that was that last. You already time. said it, <laughs> stupid. I know, but you nobody laughed at the same point. joke twice. Shh. You stay they like it. Listen. Shut up and let them laugh. There's two points in this that both have you. to be addressed. Point one: Yes, we know if you decided to swim, you might be. Like every other sport, excel past us in no time. But be honest. The bottom line is this. The reason you don't swim, community room, no pool. Rikers, no pool. That's where you're great at ping pong. Because any sport right. that can be played... In a prison. Any sport that can be played in the day room, you master. The Chinese are good at ping pong, too. Nothing for that one, folks. <laughs> the day room, and I got nothing. You know, see, the fact that you know so much about black people is really a curse to you and your white friends. What? They, they, I'm going to tell you why. Colin has a real knowledge of, like black people for some reason so when he says these black things he thinks that all white people know about community day rooms and you don't <laughs> so he's a man in purgatory black, <laughs> black people don't like him and white people don't understand him he don't know where he's going <laughs> we'll be looking back for this. <laughs> Dennis Leary, Louis Black, Janine Garofalo, Jay Moore, and a couple of latchkey TV addicted babies are part of a whole new world of stand up. It's Shorties Watching Shorties. New episode Wednesday after South Park, only on Comedy Central. Ah! Van Helsing. Ah! 
a great way to kick off the summer movie season. It has the excitement of Raiders of the Lost Ark with film's most classic creatures. Is it always like this? Pretty much. Van Helsing is incredible. Thrilling. Van Helsing! Come on! A classic. One awesome roller coaster ride. Van Helsing. Rated PG-13. At theaters tomorrow. Excuse me? Only Taco Bell has the crunchy, melty, spicy stuff you crave. Spice up the night. Open till midnight or later. How do you make caramel even better? Put it into Hershey's Kisses. Introducing Hershey's Kisses filled with caramel. It's bliss inside and out. afternoon like you promised yes will you try to sell me something i really don't need no come to midas for great value and service every day lifetime guaranteed brake pads or shoes are just 89.95 installed guaranteed for as long as you own your car trust the midas touch I agree with it. Bob Kelly's degrading to women with that remark. It was very offensive. In about two months, America will be handing over control of Iraq to the Iraqi people. Whether this will be a success or a disaster is anyone's guess. But one thing's for sure, I can't pronounce success. There are no easy choices. <laughs> to give you an idea of what this is like, it's time to play Iraq. Let's make a deal. All right, Iraq, let's make a deal. Okay, all right, let's make a deal with Iraq. Okay, this is Salah. Now, where are you from? I am from Karbala. Karbala! Woo! Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. oh. oh, you got a lot of fans here. Salah's here tonight representing the Iraqi people. Salah, are you ready to make a deal? Okay, I'll try. All right, Salah, I'm going to start out with $30 billion for infrastructure. And I didn't mean to have my voice crack then, but it did. Okay. And some nice, large American military presence. Okay. <laughs> now, the June 30th deadline's approaching. The United States is supposed to leave. But maybe it doesn't have to be that way. Do you want to keep all that you have right now and have the U.S. stay for an extra few months, probably causing more resentment and bloodshed? Or do you want to try to run the country yourselves and go with what's behind curtain number one, Salah? Well, the, the United States has been there long enough. Oh. Uh, nothing good can come of them oh. staying. Wow. <laughs> so, uh, I think I'll go with curtain number one. <laughs> oh, let's see what's my curtain number one. Open it up. Okay. Oh! 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 oh. It's a civil war. I'm sorry. Terrible. Well, Salah, that didn't work out, but I don't want to leave you empty-handed, so I'm going to give you another chance. Okay. All right. You can stay with your civil war and hope it gets better, or you can bring back the international community to keep the peace for a while, then have an election where you can choose between curtain number two or curtain number three. Salah, what do you say? Uh, I think I'll try curtain number three. Okay, you made your choice, but before we open that, let's see what you passed up behind curtain number two. Please open up curtain number two. What did you pass up? Salah. Oh, my. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, no. The people have elected a fundamentalist theocracy. I hope you women don't like to drive. Good thing you didn't go with that one, Salah. But let's see what you want instead. Come on over here. Let's see. Curtain number three, it's a, uh, oh, my God. A democratic Iraq. Yes. You finally have a nice Iraq. Salah, I hope you have people for that. It's getting a little annoying for us. Guys, we're playing Iraq. Let's make a deal. We'll be right back after this message. No 
Nobody knows Joe and Doug like their own moms. That's my boy. Plus, who'd want this guy's baby? One small step for man. One step for my bird. Comedy only a mother could love. The Man Show. New episode Sunday at 10 here on Comedy Central. That hurt my soul. On June 11th, the Chronicles of Riddick comes to theaters everywhere. But tonight, you can see the world premiere of the trailer at thechroniclesofriddick.com. You're not afraid of the dark, are you? Get into Taco Bell for the cheesy gordita crunch. Warm flatbread covered in three melted cheeses wrapped around a crunchy taco and topped with a zesty pepper jack sauce. So cheesy. I like cheesy. To get crunchy, chewy, cheesy, and melty, think outside the bun. No thanks. No. Dockers Pro Style. Shirts and pants that do it all. When it starts showing up in video games, don't let the needle pushing T5 Turbo performance mess with your mind. It's still built like a Volvo. Introducing the all-new Volvo S40. It's easy to burn off a refreshing, low-carb rock green light. I call this exercise ordering another. Woo! Hit the showers! Now you've got the green light! a clog drain or sewer backup and don't know who to call? Well, wonder no more. $49.95 any sewer or drain is serving Brooklyn, Queens, and Nassau 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. For $49.95, we will clean any one problem from your kitchen sink, your bathtub, your main sewer, or your grease separator. No extra charge for nights, weekends, or holidays. Call us at any one of our numbers you see on the screen or visit us on the web. Remember, if you didn't call us, you paid too much. President Bush went on Arab TV last night to smooth things over. It's always best to open with a joke. Give George W. some openers that would have appealed to an Arab audience. Robert Kelly. Yeah. My re-election campaign, $40 million. The war with Iraq, $80 million. Pictures of Iraqi prisoners playing naked twister, priceless. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Doug, Doug Davidoff. All right. <laughs> First off, I'm serious. Does anybody have any weed? <laughs> All right, no, I think maybe he could have opened with, you know, like, just come out to you, look, uh, my name is George Bush. Uh, you can call me Sheriff. Because <laughs> I am. <laughs> In America, or more importantly, Texas, taking pictures of naked men piled on top of another naked man is a sign of respect for one another, for one's country, and for another man's ass. <laughs> so stop being a bunch of crap, babe. All right, Tony, come in. First off, he should open with, I don't speak Arabic, so you'll just, I'll just clear my throat and hope I'm saying something. <laughs> but I'm glad to be here on Arabian Idol. Sorry about all that death and destruction. She bangs, she bangs! All right, <laughs> Patrice O'Neill. Hey, everybody. Uh, can I do a George Bush brother? <laughs> hey, everybody. Two Jews walk into a bar, buy it, and then blow up a guy sitting in a wheelchair. Waka waka! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, come on. The woman soldier thought that the naked terrorist was carrying a stick of dynamite. Uh, dynamite? Dynamite, sorry. <laughs> but I guess he was just glad to see her. Oh, come on, folks. <laughs> <laughs> just jostling around. <laughs> those, pictures, those pictures and the treatment of, of the prisoners were terrible. Yeah, but... Uh, <laughs> would you rather have Saddam 
or sawdust me. Get it? Get it? Come on, folks. But seriously, where are those weapons at? All right. That is our show. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>